What's up, CPL? Um, I promise this is a CPL video, but it's difficult for me to make a video in my chem lab and not, I don't know, just take a moment to do something kind of fun. So um, before I tell you our big CPL announcement, um, just have a little concoction here that I've mixed together that will hopefully be cool to volatile liquid that evaporates quickly. So fill in some gas in there. Find out if this works cool on camera, then we'll talk about this. Yeah? Cool, right? Anyway, maybe it would talk. <laughs> What's up everybody? Um here, let me get a small light so I can see. Um Hi everyone. Um I'll try to be as uh, brief as I can with the uh, announcement that I have to make today. But before I make the announcement, I want to brag a little bit. Um, um, just a little bit about CPL and uh, where we've come over over the eleven years. We've a uh, We've existed for 11 years, but we've also existed for 13 seasons during that time. Um, sometimes the people look at the pictures that are hanging in um, the CPL uh, main, uh, the, the final table room, and it says that we have 11 seasons, but there's more than 11 pictures, and they just think I can't count. Uh, but I'd like to remind you there were two years where uh, we had dual seasons. Uh, we had uh, CPL Pro existed for two years because um, our roster got so big that we were unable to... Um, we were unable to fill the uh, uh, everyone into one league. So we made one league that cost a little bit more. It was called Season A and Season B. So anyways, 13 seasons. Um, and I and all the directors that have worked with me are very proud of that. Of course, Craig Spooner being the other director um, currently. Another cool bragging point is I went back and I added up the amount of money that CPL has given away to winners. And the total amount of money that we've paid out is $29,275 over the course of 13 seasons. So um, hopefully you've gotten at least a piece of that cash, but um, <laughs> it's I think it's cool that we've uh, we've handed out some um, some cool money. We've also had some other cool moments where we've uh, we've coined some terms that people still use. Um, of course, everyone's favorite being boom. I don't, a student might come across this video, so I won't finish the other half of Boom, but you know what the other half of Boom is. Um, over the course of these 11 years, we've uh, we've made new friends. Um, I could name specific people, but then I would leave someone out. I don't want to do that. But you know who you are, people that I met because of the league, and now we hang out, and I love that. Um, CPL made the friend group get bigger. <coughs> and while we still play as much poker as we can, um, we get to hang out socially with, with new people. But while we've gained people over the 13 year, uh, 11 years, um, we've, we've lost people too, not in a sad way, but um, <clears throat> in a they've gone on to bigger life things way. Um, what we've seen our roster do over the course of time is almost all of the declines have been due to people moving, have been due to people getting married, have been due to mostly kids. Um, when we started in 2011, there was a lot less children running all over the place. And uh, now there's kids everywhere, um, which, of course, is, uh, is wonderful. Um, over the course of this time, though, all of these changes that have forced other players to, to disappear on us, I, I've been immune from it for some reason. Um, I've only missed two tournaments out of uh, playing in 13 seasons. And with how crazy life is, I've, I've always just been, I've just been happy that it's worked out, that, um, that the Sundays have have been available, but I'm no longer immune. Um, those of y'all that were at the last tournament know that <coughs> the, I promise I'm not sick, I just can't quit coughing <coughs> for some reason, but um, know that at the end of the tournament, I rushed everybody out the door because um, Colby, my oldest daughter, was having her first force practice and I was missing the beginning of it. And it was just a practice, so it wasn't a huge deal, but um, I didn't like the way it made me feel. And uh, we're at the very beginning of this new Colby volleyball thing. And um, 
I have tournaments I'm about to miss. Um, I'm 100% missing the January tournament of season 11 because I'm going to, there's a volleyball game and I'm not missing a volleyball game. And uh, looking forward, it's only going to get more hectic. So um, I'm glad it took 11 years to get to this point. But suddenly Sunday CPL um, is a challenge for me. Not only that, but my wonderful wife, Crystal, um, has embarked on travel nursing. And while she's out of state right now, her next contracts will be local, uh, which is very good. I miss her so much. But um, her, just, just her unpredictability every time she takes a new contract, it's just, y'all, CPL is going to take a hiatus. Season 11, our 13th season, will be the last season for now. Um, I'm not dissolving the league. It's not like, oh, let's cry, CPL is over. That's not the case. It's just league play is going to take a break. Um, so there won't be a season 12 for you to register for um, <coughs> for March. And I'll be in the middle of volleyball and not trying to juggle 10 million things. Now, if you're sitting there thinking, well, couldn't you just hand it off to somebody else? Or um, couldn't you be a teammate player? Or isn't there something you could do that doesn't involve you um, canceling it? Trust me, this wasn't, I didn't see volleyball and say CPL's over. This was a calculated um, decision. I talked with several people. Um, of course, Craig Spooner was um, a big voice in it. And then Crystal was another big voice in it. And measuring the possibilities of handing leadership over, which I've like, yes, yeah, CPL is my baby, but I'm not I, I, I'm not obsessive about it. Um, if I, I would much rather it live in someone else's hands so that I could just come back to it without, you know, this hiatus possibly destroying rosters for the future. Um, but as we looked at the longevity of that and um, and just different um, aspects and variables that uh, I don't want to make this video 20 minutes on, this is the better choice for right now. So, I'm sorry. Um, I know that there's, uh, I mean, I play poker more regularly outside of CPL, but I know a lot of y'all don't. And um, I don't want to fail you as your, uh, your poker ambassador, but um, there's other things that we still plan to do, though. I said we're not dissolving CPL because the plan is to still have our special events. So, <coughs> um, so special events in March and September is usually what we have been trying to gravitate around. We've gone off that a couple of years, but I think we're going back to it. So I'll keep you fully in the loop, fully updated. I'm hoping we can, um, you know, throw some more casual stuff in there like we used to, um, especially since Sundays are no longer going to exist in March. Um, so I'll keep you totally in the loop on that if you want to be in the loop. All right, you can always tell me to go away. But um, anyway, it gives me no joy to put the Cibolo Poker League on hiatus. Um, I do want to thank you, though. Uh, we've had so many people come in and out and back in. Um, we've had some people come back in and start dominating, which is fantastic. It's, it's, it's exciting to watch. It's always been one of the most fabulous parts is watching y'all grow as poker players and hanging out with y'all, laughing with y'all, and just having a, uh, a great time. So thank you for letting this exist. Um, hopefully the uh, memories stay strong. I know Colby and Saren um, will have uh, deep memories of it because we've been the poker house for so long. And um, I hope to continue being the poker house just in a, uh, a smaller capacity. So um, I didn't want to just send out a text or a message. This is one of those bigger decisions that um, I feel like uh, just deserves it to come straight for me. So if you have any questions, um, let me know. But um, again, just to summarize, CPL season 11 is the last season of CPL until further notice. Thank you all for watching and uh, good luck at the tables wherever they might be.